Hey everyone, Had here. I'm joined today with my good friend and fellow artist, Emma Coates. You are a lesbian, are you not? I am a lesbian. What would you say is your favorite part of being a lesbian? Well, there's so many advantages to being a woman dating women, um, it's hard to pick just one. I mean, well, there's also a lot of perks to being a guy dating another guy. Yeah, but I think there are more to dating women. It's definitely better to be a guy dating another guy. And no, it's better to be a lesbian. No, it's better to be gay. Better to be a lesbian. Gay. Lesbian. Gay. Lesbian. Gay. Lesbian. Lesbian. Gay versus lesbian. Start! Perks of being a lesbian. You can see boobs from across the room, so you know what you're getting yourself into. It doesn't work that way with guys, does it? No, I guess you're right. I mean, with guys, it's always a surprise. You open up that package, you have no idea what you're gonna get. It could be a Mini Cooper or an Escalade. Benefits of being gay, I can wrestle with my partner in bed, and I don't have to worry about hurting him. I think most lesbians could beat you up. Lesbians, no cleanup after sex. Yeah, I mean, that's definitely true. With guys, between the sweat, the buckets of lube, and the collateral splatter, everything's pretty much soaked. When it's two guys together, we don't have to worry about periods. Period. Ever. At all. That's true, but when I'm with a woman, she understands what I'm going through, and if we're living together, our cycles can line up, and we can get that done with in one week. Yeah, I mean, I guess that makes sense. But so how does it work with straight couples? Minus one for straight couples. Being gay means you don't have to learn how to take off those pesky bras. I could take a dude's undies off with one hand. I could do it with one finger. All you gotta do is hook and pull. Girls wanna cuddle after. I wanna cuddle after. When you're a guy dating another guy, your wardrobe doubles. You guys, you get to share each other's clothes. Yeah, I guess that only works if you're that lesbian couple that looks exactly the same. It doesn't really work for straight couples, right? I mean, they can't really share each other's wardrobes. But it's cute when a girl wears her boyfriend's sweatshirt. Yeah, but that's not sharing, that's stealing. I know how to make other women come. Gays don't have to worry about making women come. Men don't stick their long hairs to the walls in the shower. Women don't leave beard clippings all over the sink. Gays, we can get sex whenever we want, even if you're not in a relationship. Seriously, if you're gay, all you have to do is open up Grinder, and you can pretty much get laid. Wait, so your plus is that gays have Grinder? I mean, well, when you say it like that, it doesn't sound like a plus. Lesbians are understanding of hairy legs. I'm understanding of hairy legs. Are straight men understanding of hairy legs? I don't think they're having any of that. Minus another point for straight couples. Gays never have to awkwardly buy tampons for their girlfriends. Lesbians don't have to buy condoms. Condoms are really expensive. The tampons are expensive too. Really? Yeah. Straight couples have to buy all of these things. When I get hit in the nuts, my partner would understand. He'd be able to console me. Like, what would you say to make my ball sack feel better? Ooh. <laughs> I don't get yelled at for leaving the toilet seat up. We never leave the toilet seat up. Oh yeah. I guess that's only a straight problem. Lesbians don't have to worry as much about STDs. Yeah, that's true. Gays have to be pretty conscious about that. But it's still not as bad as straight couples. I mean, they're at risk every single time of contracting the worst STD of all time. A kid. Ugh. <laughs> Shoot me now. How many serial killers are women? I don't have to pretend not to like chick flicks. Sex without poop. Women have mood swings. Men smell terrible. Hot flashes. Boner problems. Saggy boobs. Ear hair. No wonder half of all straight marriages end in divorce. Men and women have nothing in common. Yeah, being straight sounds terrible. It sounds awful. I am so happy I don't have to deal with women. And I'm so happy I don't have to deal with men. So I guess we can both agree that gays and lesbians have it much better than straight couples. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Good. I mean, seriously, what the fuck do straight couples even talk about? The weather? Hey, I think you and I could have a real stable relationship. Because of my horse cock. You have really nice eyes. Can I touch them? You make me wish I was a dentist, so I could fill your cavity. I know how to make other women come. Come where? <laughs> <laughs> and done.